Tonight, business owners are reacting to President Trump's plan to tax Mexican imports as a way to pay for the border wall. Channel 5's Steve Solis spoke with a Valley business owner who says the move would have a major impact on his company. Steve? Well, there are many businesses here in the Valley that import items from Mexico. They then sell those imported items right here in the U.S. A McAllen business owner tells us if this 20% tax on imports gets the green light, he won't be the only one having to pay more money. Jesse De Leon's business revolves around goods imported from Mexico. Different designs, all hand painted. They come out of Guerrero. Each piece in his unique shop originates from south of the border. I would say about half of the items that we sell comes in from Mexico, and the other half comes in from Mexico, but as raw materials, basically antique doors, uh, iron hardware, things like that that we use to create uh, mirrors, furniture, uh, crosses, things like that. People all over the world buy from De Leon's store of Mexican imports. Just yesterday we shipped to Denmark, we shipped to Ireland today. President Trump plans to tax imported goods coming in from Mexico. This would pay for the border wall. De Leon says the move would have a big impact on Valley businesses. More so for me because the majority of my items are coming from Mexico. So, you know, it's just you have to pass that cost on and it's, and it's just... It's kind of unfair. De Leon says it would be a bad deal for the everyday shopper. You're really not doing a tax on Mexico. You're doing a tax on the consumer because what's going to happen is if I have to pay 20% more for, for the items I get out of Mexico, guess who's going to pay the other 20%? It's going to be the consumers. President Trump will work with Congress on the details of his plan. De Leon knows there's not much he can do. In the end, it, I, you just if it happens, just take the hit and... That's all you can do. In the meantime, De Leon will continue to get what he can from Mexico before any tax is put in place. I mentioned on Channel 5 News at 10 that Texas alone could contribute close to $17 billion a year under a 20% import tax. Now, White House Press Secretary Sean Spicer says about $10 billion a year could fund the border wall. The Trump administration will keep working on developing their plan for funding construction of the wall, and we will continue to track this ongoing story. Count on Channel 5 News to keep you up to date. Live in studio, Steve Solis, Channel 5 News at 1030.